welcome back to your Feel Good Breakfast Show. It is Expresso right here on SABC3. Now, today is a very special day. It's a day that we celebrate the one thing that most people can't live without in the morning. It's what kickstarts the day for all of us here at Expresso. Some of us need it more than others very early in the morning. In fact, we love this thing so much that the show name is a play on the word that describes it. Yes, you guessed it. It's International Coffee Day. And making the perfect cup of coffee is an important skill that everyone should know. And with the help of coffee master David Dondi, no one should should ever have a bad cup of coffee ever, ever again. Totally David, agree. so good to have you good here. Good to be here. Now, you know what? A good cup of coffee is essential to me. I think I'm a coffee snob. What good. are some of the basic elements that we have to employ when making that first brew of the day? We don't want to take things for granted. So freshly ground means just this. Yes. Grind it as you're going to use it. And the quantity is so important. Yeah. You know, they always say one spoon per cup. Yeah. I don't know what size spoon and I don't know what size <laughs> cup. And it can all get quite complicated, but I've got a really easy method to make coffee. Yeah. Just bring a South African champion barista with you. Jose! It's always the easy the way South to do it. South African champion barista. <laughs> yeah. Oh, yes. I'm in the presence of royalty here. Exactly. All right, so, so what are you doing? What's really important is water temperature. Another thing taken for granted. You don't want to use boiling water. So really? what we're going to do here is we're going to use cold water to form an emulsion in a plunger. And this applies for any kind of filter brew method. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to time it. Three okay. minutes. It really yeah. makes a difference. And then we're going to top it up with oh. boiling water. We prepared this one earlier. Mm -hmm. And it really is the simplest, simplest, simplest method You don't method want to burn the coffee. Ever. You don't want to burn the coffee. Yeah. And it's so important that you, you don't take these basic elements. And they're so yeah. easy to pull off. And it, it really, it, it makes all the difference. Yeah. But that timer, the that three timer minutes, is essential. everything. No less than three minutes, yeah. no more than four minutes. Most people go, oh, well, mm. about. But it, it really is vital. And then the beans themselves. Oh, now the aroma that I'm getting. Ah. Yeah. <laughs> um, when it comes to the beans that you use at yeah. Truth, how do you make sure that the quality is consistently consistent. <laughs> First off, the coffee that you use. Coffee is an agricultural yeah. product. So that green bean has all the flavor that it's ever going to have. And believe it or not, like wine, we have this horrible world mm. co word called terroir. And it's the flavor of place. And yeah. where it's grown and how it's grown is going to have all the difference. And then in roasting, we have to not over roast it, which is going to cause bitterness, yeah. not strength, bitterness. Yes. And under roasting will cause grassy, sour, weird tastes. So getting that just right. And then the brewing method. Grind it too fine and again it'll go bitter. Too yeah. coarse you won't get the fly flavor. Do it just right and we've got what we call magic. Wow, it is and, definitely and magic. And there we go. And it really is as simple as that. Wow. And off we go. It looks Happiness. amazing. You know what? Coffee is so important, especially that first cup you don't want to get it wrong. Thank you so much, David. Our Thank pleasure. you so much, Jose, for being here with us. Great. Definitely showing us how to make the perfect cup of coffee.